तो हेलो वेलकम आज हम देखेंगे कि एनपीटीएल का कंप्यूटर नेटवर्क्स एंड इंटरनेट प्रोटोकॉल का वीक एट असाइनमेंट नंबर एट सो क्वेश्चन नंबर वन वेन यू कनेक्ट यूर पर्सनल कंप्यूटर दैट इज एन डिवाइसेस और होस्ट टू द इंटरनेट सो हाउ डज हाउ डज इट नो असाइन इट्स ओन आई पी एड्रेस एंड द गेट वे आई पी एड्रेस टू यूज फॉर सेंडिंग पैकेट्स टू रिमोट होस्ट Without any manual configuration, so to assign its own IP address uh, and the gateway IP address to use for sending packets to the remote hosts, without any manual configuration, that is the DSCP, Dynamic Host Configuration Protocol, that is the option number D. Okay. So its explanation is that DSCP, that is the Dynamic Host Configuration Protocol, is a network management protocol. Used on IP networks, where a DSCP server dynamically assigns an IP address and other network configuration. Okay, so the parameters to devices that are connected to the network. When a devices like a personal computer connects to a network, it sends. Okay, it sends out a broadcast request for DSCP servers. So the DSCP server then responds with an available IP address, subnet mask, and gateway IP address. That is the DNS server IP address, domain name system server IP address, and other configuration parameters. So this process allows devices to automatically obtain the necessary network configuration without manual configuration. So its answer will be dynamic host configuration protocol. Option number D. So question number two: When do you consider dividing an IP address into the network address and host address? So, uh, dividing an IP address into network address and host address. Let uh, so why do you consider? So, its answer will be that option number C: To avoid the overhead, okay, of storing all possible host IP addresses in each router. So dividing an IP address into the network address and host address allows for efficient routing in large networks. So the routers use the network portion for the IP address to determine the appropriate paths for, for to forward the packets. Okay, without needing to store every individual host addresses. So this scheme to Helps to minimize the amount of routing information that routers need to maintain the processes and reducing the overheads to improve the network efficiency. So, its answer will be option number C to avoid the overhead of storing all possible hosts IP address in each router. Question number third: Which of the following statement are correct? The internet is a single network controlled by by one organization. Incorrect. Uh, statement number two: A transit AS can also be a stop AS. It also incorrect. All AS must have the same local routing algorithm. That actually not same. So this also incorrect. Statement number I B: Distance vector routing and link state routing protocols are the example of intra-domain routing. Uh, this this statement is correct. So only I B means option number C only the correct. Yes. Question number four: For the following network, what will be the routing table for C? Okay. What will be the routing table for C if if we use link state routing? So in link state routing, okay. So there are uh, four, uh, next hub that is the four next hub that is the a uh, two a b d e and uh, next hub next hub is the b b d b. Okay. So its answer will be option number a. That is two a b d e and next hub is the b b d b. So option number a. Yes. Question five: In BGP protocol, update and notification messages are used for. So, in BGP protocol, BGP means Border Gateway Protocol. Uh, that is the update and notification messages are used for. Okay. 
सो so, इसका आंसर हो जाएगा कि एक्सेजिंग रिलेबिलिटी इन्फॉर्मेशन एंड टू नोटिफाई एन एर तो इसका एक्सप्रेंस नहीं होगा कि ऑब्डेट मैसेजेस इन बीजीबी बॉर्डर गेटवे प्रोटोकॉल आर यूज टू एक्सचेंज राउटिंग इन्फॉर्मेशन बिटवीन द बीजीबी पियर्स इंक्लूडिंग इन्फॉर्मेशन अबाउट रिसेबल नेटवर्क एंड द पार टू बी रीज देम सो ये हो गया ऑब्डेट एंड नोटिफिकेशन इज द मैसेजेस आर यूज टू रिपोर्ट एरर्स और एनामलीज इन द बीजीपी सेशन सच एज अनरिचेबल प्योर टू इनवैलिड राउटिंग इन्फॉर्मेशन सो इसका आंसर हो जाएगा ऑप्शन नंबर सी दैट इज एक्सचेंजिंग द रिचेबिलिटी इन्फॉर्मेशन एंड टू नोटिफाई एन एर क्वेश्चन नंबर सिक्स हुई इज ट्रू अबाउट बॉर्डर गेटवे प्रोटोकॉल दैट इज द बीजीपी राउटिंग प्रोटोकॉल ओके सो इसका आंसर हो जाएगा ऑप्शन नंबर डी दैट इज द बीजीपी रिलाइज ऑन आई जी पी फॉर पैकेट फॉरवर्डिंग बिटवीन आई बी जी पी पीयर्स तो इसका एक्सप्लेनेशन होगा कि बीजेपी दैट इज द बॉर्डर गेटवे प्रोटोकॉल इज प्राइमरीली एंड इंट्राडोमेन राउटिंग प्रोटोकॉल एंड यूज टू एक्सचेंज द राउटिंग इन्फॉर्मेशन बिटवीन डिफरेंट ऑटोनोमस सिस्टम ओके दैट इज एस एक्स सो विद इन एन एस बीजेपी स्पीकर्स ओके एंड एट इज यूज आई बीजेपी दैट इज इंटरनाल बीजेपी टू एक्सचेंज राउटिंग इन्फॉर्मेशन सो हाई ओवर बीजेपी इट सेल्फ डज नट हैंडल द इंटरनाल राउटिंग विद इन an s so it relies on interior gateway protocol that is igp such as osp that is open source path fast or isis for the for that the future purpose so iska answer ho jayega option number d yes bgp relies on igp for packet forwarding between ibgp peers question number 7 BGP communication packet types are actually BGP communication packet types are this is the increasing order that is the open update notification and key pair like so option number B so is the experience nahi hoga and that is the correct sequence is open update notification and key pair like so these are the four main BGP message types that is the open open is the used to establish a BGP connection and negotiate parameters. then update update is the used to exchange routing information between the bgp peers then notification it used to report errors or anomalies in the bgp session then the last one it is the keep alive it is used to maintain the connection and verify that the peer is still reachable so is can so there seven number b yes question number 8 this is the straight forward question that is the open source path fast way os os pp is the link state routing protocol option number b सो so, इसका एक्सप्लेन नहीं हो जाएगा कि ओ एस पी एफ ओपन शॉर्टेस्ट पाथ फास्ट इज ए लिंक स्टेट राउटिंग प्रोटोकॉल यूज्ड फॉर राउटिंग विद एन विद इन एन ऑटोनोमस सिस्टम दैट इज ए एस इन ओ एस पी एफ राउटर्स एक्सचेंज इन्फॉर्मेशन अबाउट द स्टेट ऑफ देयर लिंक्स थ्रो द लिंक स्टेट एडवर्टाइजमेंट दैट इज एल एस एस सो दिस इन्फॉर्मेशन इज यूज टू बिल्ड a complete topological map okay that is the physical connection between the networks so it to allow the routers to calculate the shortest path to each destination using register algorithm so its answer ho jayega option number b the ospf is link state routing protocol then question number 9 which type of routing protocol uses the bellman ford algorithm to calculate the best path for the forwarding ip ip packets so bellman ford algorithm protocol uses distance vector routing protocol that is the option number b to so, iska explanation ho jayega ki distance vector routing protocol like rip that is routing information protocol it utilizes the bellman ford algorithm to determine the best path for the forwarding the ip ip packets so this algorithm iteratively calculates the shortest path to all the destination based on the distance vectors that exchanged between neighboring routers so bellman ford uses the distance vector routing protocol that is the dbrp question number 10 consider a network with three routers that is let's say abc so the routing table for each router the a has the following ent entries that is the destination 
the IP address is 192.168.1.0 slash 24. Okay, the, uh, actually it is the CIDR, classless interdomain routing. And, and uh, next hope is the B, then destination. Next destination kya hai? Ki 192.168.1.128 slash 28. Iska no, next hope kya hai? D. Third ka destination 192 dot one sixty dot two dot zero slash twenty four so next will be C so if router A receives an IP packets with a destination address that is one ninety two dot one sixty eight dot one dot one zero so what will the next hope for this packets okay so its explanation he will jaga he to determine the next hope for the IP packet with the Destination address that is the 192.168.1.10. So we need to find the most specific matching entry actually in the routing table of router A. So the destination address that is the 192.168.1.10 falls within, within the subnet that is the what? 192.168.1.0 slash 24. So the enter so the entry location destination IP address is 192.168.1.0 slash 24. So the next hope, the to next hope, kya ho jayega? B is the best match because it covers a larger range of IP address than the other entries. So therefore, the next hope for the packet will be router B. So router B, which option is option number B? Yes. So question number one ka D, two C, then third ka C, four A. Then five ka C six D then seven B eight B nine B and ten B okay, submit. So thank you for taking the wicket assignment number eight. So thank you.